Hello everyone, it's Myla. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be going over my June empties. Um, but first I want to say uh, happy 4th of July weekend, happy Independence Day, and I hope everyone's doing well. And let's get started on what I've melted. I'm actually very proud of what I've melted. So yeah, okay. <laughs> the first one I have here is... Um, strawberry pound cake lemonade by rose girls it was a bunny and um i put this in my kitchen it was really really good loved it that was a good performer um the next one i have here is um l3 waxy wonders it was a sample and it's uh here here's jenny don't cross streams pumpkin pecan waffles pretzel bakery bomb adipose vanilla cookies vanilla wafers vanilla ice cream. This was a sample and it did very well. So, and I think I have a puppy pack in this, so I'm glad. <laughs> the next one I have here is, um, uh, scoopable tart wax and it's my, one of my favorites and it's, uh, cake by the ocean and cake by the ocean is, uh, birthday cake, Florida key lime pie and strawberry pound cake. I had um, hearts in this. This performed very, very well. So, and that was Cake by the Ocean. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I finished up my uh, Sassy Girl Aroma Cupcakes at Tiffany's. And I was, I like her cupcake. I, excuse me. I like her cupcakes at Tiffany's. It's very good, but I do like K's better though, but this is a personal preference, but I finished this one up and it was one of those like, um, chunky pies, but it was like in a square shape form and I had it chopped up. So I finished that one. Um, I finished, uh, let's see, this is Hayden row, um, candle company and it's fizzy pop. And this was a sample. It did well. Great performer. This one was a little light, and this is um, Aaliyah, and it's sweet raspberry and vanilla wafers. And I actually put this one in the candle crock, and it was it was light, but it was pretty. Light but pretty. Um, I have. Uh, up the creek scents and this is a uh, cookie coma cake pop and up the creek is uh excellent very very good um i finished a uh, creamy zucchini sugar cookie by up the creek scents and lately with um zucchini bread certain ones i've been getting like a corn chip smell and this one had it a little bit. So what I've been doing is uh, blending it with like some type of fruit. But I mean, it was still, it still performed very well. Now this one, ooh, this one is good. This is um, L3's uh, Peeps, blueberries, blueberries and cream and zucchini bread. This was one of those little rabbits that she had. Um, so good. This one, this little rabbit went for days. <laughs> like it took me a little bit to get through this. So, um, excellent. This was such a beautiful blend. Um, I finished up, uh, Southern flair and it's blackberry jam, butter cookies, uh, blackberry jam, butter cookies, vanilla waffle cone and cotton candy. And this is from sassy girl aroma. I think sassy is always a good solid for me. So. Yep. I like this one. This one was nice. A good solid medium. <laughs> this one is um, Up the Creek Scents and it's pistachio pudding, strawberry pound cake. Oh my goodness. What a beautiful blend this was. And I have to say with Up the Creek, like the performance on her wax is very good. Very, very good. So this I love, and I think she's got a couple left on her website, but I'm trying to be good and melt through what I have before I place another order. 
<laughs> anyway, um, I have a sample of Dessa's homespun uh, scents, and it's strawberry pound cake. Um, it was a pretty strawberry pound cake, but it was kind of light, but it was pretty. I finished up a uh, waxy taffy, and this was a sample. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, it's starfruit mango lime soda, and this one was strong. <laughs> very nice. Very, very nice. Speaking of strong, <laughs> I finished up a uh, waxy taffy marvelous mint, and it's for all my mint lovers. Uh, great to blend or on its own. Icy peppermint, twisted peppermint, candy canes, and creamy buttermints. Whew. That one I finished up. That one was good. That was very strong. Um, this one is by Vintage, Vintage Chic Scents, and it's When We All Fall Asleep, Where Do We Go? And it's Sweet Lavender Malt, Blackberry Jam, and Vanilla Bean Noel. And this one... Um, it was a little light, but it was pretty. This one was excellent, and this was strong and beautiful. And this was um, by L3, and it was a sample um, blackberry jam crumb cake. There it is. Um, I have, these were the hearts from... Um, Scoopable Tart Wax, and this is Wildberry Ice Cream Scoop bread and it's super strong blend of strawberry and blueberry blended with ice cream scoop bread this was nice very nice um i finished uh tagalongs by l3 and this was an older sample um i think my son had this one in his room yeah it's like a fresh scent citrusy no complaints from him <laughs> uh I finished up lemon snowdrop cookies and I put this one in the, um, by Rose Girls and I put this in the candle crock and it did well. So yes. And this one is, I, I mean, I don't know how old it is, but that looks a little old, but it did well in the candle crock. Um, I finished up, uh, Aruba coconut by rainbow melts and it's a, sample and it was a uh, citrus rich sweet coconut a burst of the islands and i put this in my kitchen did very well medium a good solid medium mm. Ooh, this one is strong this is shirley temple and it's a cherry fizzy pops and this is from 2021 excellent excellent um, this is Rainbow Melts, and it's called Chill Out. Um, pink sugar, lavender, and chamomile. I didn't really get much pink sugar. I mostly got lavender and chamomile, but I melted this at night, so it was pretty. Okay, I finished up one of those like snap, they look like snap bars from um, VCS. Um, and this is from April of 2022, and it's just the pink sugar type, and I just used it as a blender. So I finished that one up, and I love pink sugar. Uh, I finished up a sample of, uh, or a sampler of um, peppermint lavender cupcakes at Tiffany's. This was really nice, very nice. Um, I finished up, oh my gosh, I love this. When I first received this, this is Sassy Girl Aroma, and it's a true love story, and it's her little, um, what does she call them, brick blocks? Anyway, little squares. Um, and it's uh, serendipity uh, fudge butter and sugar cookies. And when I first received this, I didn't like it on first sniff. I was like, eh. And then when I melted it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so good. I fell in love with serend serendipity. And um, I remember my son came in my room and he was like, why does it smell like mashed potatoes and corn in here? I was like, <laughs> I'm like, where are you getting that from? But um, this is a true love story and I have a, a loaf in this too. So this was really good. I feel like Sassy is always a good solid performer. 
this one was strong. I put this one in my kitchen and it's um, the pharmacist's daughter and it's seven up pound cake and it's vanilla pound cake, seven up pound cake, pineapple, coconut, and vanilla buttercream. And this was like a souffle. It was excellent. I put it in the, um, I have a tea light warmer in my kitchen. Wow. It was great. Okay. The next one I have here is um, pink sugar serendipity and rice crispy treats. And this is like a, a snowflake. Wow. This was so good. Strong really strong. <laughs> Excellent. Love this one. Um, I finished up the, uh, with scoopable tart wax. Um, this is one boy and one girl and it's pink sugar type, blue sugar type and breast day cake. And it was the little hearts. Well, she had like four hearts in the bag. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Back to um, scoopable tart wax. So this is one boy, one girl. And it's what I like about this is you get the pink sugar, the blue sugar, and then that birthday cake, which kind of evens out that sweetness from um, the pink sugar. But to me, I get like Palo Santo vibes with it, but it was very, very nice. And this was strong, excellent. Um, I have here, um, which is for good and it's fresh watermelon slices, uh, fluffy laundry and sweet sponge sugar. This one is kind of light and I know, um, usually like the fresher blends are stronger, but I mean, it was still nice though. And that was from VCS. Uh, I finished up cake by the ocean um, another cake. I don't, did I go over cake by the ocean already? Maybe I did or not. Anyway, I finished up cake by the ocean. Um, and this is a uh, birthday cake, Florida key lime pie and strawberry pound cake. Very, very good. Love it. Excellent. Excellent blend. Great for summer. Oh my gosh. I have a lot here. Sorry. <laughs> um, pink chiffon Jackie O by VCS which is rich vanilla bean cake topped with whipped marshmallows and sh pink chiffon. I have a blossom bar in this now. Love this. This one was light. This is um, strawberry pound cake, cotton candy, pink sugar, and it's from H2 Wax Co. And they were like little snap bars. I mean, the bag smells good. This was very light. It's okay though. All right, I finished uh, Tim McGraw and it's uh, sugared peach slices, brown sugar and fig and rich sugar cookies. I ended up buying the Blossom Bar because she had 20% off and I love this. It's such a beautiful blend and the performance on that was excellent. Uh, I have um, straw, uh, my scoopable tart wax was like one of those ice cream scoops and I have a few of these. Um, but moving on, uh, it's peppermint ice cream and strawberry jam. It's just a pretty blend. Very, very pretty. I feel like ice cream, um, or like ice cream scoop kind of mellows everything out and kind of lightens it a little bit, just a little bit, but it's still very, very nice. And that was a good solid medium. Ooh, I finished up uh, blueberry sugar cookies. And this is from up the Creek scents. So good, strong and excellent. I love up the Creek now. Okay. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, I finished up, uh, first ladies cafe and it's tropical fruits, lemon, lime, limes, sugared oranges, which says volcano type in parentheses, and fresh picked strawberries. Great. And this was from 2021. And it, oof, I love it. Excellent. This is from L3, and this is from 2021, and this is gold sugar and Palo Santo. This did very, very well. I finished up uh, blueberry pistachio pudding cake. I love her 
pistachio. It's so good. Up the creek scents. Really good. I finished up ice cream. This is um, the ice cream scoop from um, Scoopable Tart Wax. And it's strawberry jam um, and cupcakes at Tiffany's. Wow. Strong. Beautiful. Excellent. Loved it. I have peppermint cotton candy cupcakes from Rose Girls. And it's peppermint cotton candy frosting and vanilla cupcakes. Very good. Um, I, I finished a, I think it's like a snap bar from um, Up the Creek Scents. And this is blueberry pecan waffles, waffle sugar cookies. And excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay. Um, purple haze, um, VIVCS, jelly glazed donuts, gooey marshmallows, and zucchini bread. I wish I got a blossom bar in this. I got something, I got a loaf from her, which has jelly glazed donuts and zucchini bread, but I think it's called dazed or something. So, but anyway, I love this blend. I love her zucchini blend bread. Um, I finished Candyland from Rose Girls. I put this in the um, candle crock and it did very well. Billy's Buttermints by VCS. Love it. Excellent. This is um, the pharmacist daughter's uh, Just Ripe and this, is, this was strong. This is um, Vanilla Bean Noel Cashmere Snowdrop Brown Sugar and Fig. And it kind of has like a masculine vibe to it. So um, this was in my son's room. And I could just smell it all through the house. So this was very strong. Uh, we have Lavender pe Peppermint Coconut Mallow from Rose Girls. Another good one. Um, I also have, uh, you should see me in a crown and it's blueberry muffins, cupcakes at Tiffany's and zucchini bread. And this blend is just so nice. This is from 2022 and it did very well. Um, blackberry jam butter cookies from Rose Girls. And, um, you know, I was, let me go to smell the bag. Oh, I love her blackberry jam butter cookies. I think I have one more upstairs right now. But um yeah, I just I was I was just listening to what other people were saying that um they were saying that her wax, like her bakery, um after a year kind of tones down a little bit or you're not you don't get to it's not as strong. So I was trying to like melt through some of my older rose girls, but I mean so far so good. I mean, I haven't really had any issues, knock on wood. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> moving on. We have Strawberry Fields Forever, and it's strawberries and cream and zucchini bread. This was nice. Not a good solid medium, but it was pretty with that strawberries and cream and the zucchini bread. Yummy. I finished Sweet Pink Holiday, and it's pink sugar, frosted pink cake, and vanilla bean Noel from Rainbow Melts. And I love this. This was a good, like strong, medium strong. Excellent. Um, I finished up Super Tarts Wax, and it's peppermint, pink sugar, and vanilla bean. And this, um, I think it was from 2020, last year. Um, this one, they were like little squares and it was like pink and white. I liked it. I melted it at night. Very nice. Um, blueberry jelly donut. Now, this is from Rose Girls. And I know I just said that about the whole bakery thing. I think I went nose blind to this because 
I have backups of this and I melted this last month as well. And it was so strong. And then I think I went a little nose blind to this one, but, um, anyway, I melted this one and enjoyed it, but I think I got to take a break from it. Cause I've been melting. Like I was on like a blueberry kick anyway, moving on. Uh, I have, um, Jillian and Sally, and it's a uh, strawberry pound cake and vanilla lace. Oh, this was beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I have Kay's blackberry jam butter cookies. And I think, hmm, this wasn't as strong as Rose Girls, but it was a good solid medium. I have Kay's um, Baccarat Rouge 540. Oh my gosh, her Baccarat is good. And what it is, is um, I think it says uh, Amber, Ambergris, Saffron, Jasmine, and Cedar. This wasn't like strong, but it was a good solid medium. Now, Kay's Blueberry Pancakes. Whew, strong. <laughs> I need to get another one of these. Ooh, really good too if you like blueberry okay we have um it's hard to be a diamond in a rhinestone world and this is strawberry pound cake cupcakes at tiffany's and rich sugar cookies oh my gosh look it has little like <laughs> this was good i wish i got a blossom bar in it but i think i have another um clamshell of this uh, Up the Creek Scents, Pink Pie Crust Zucchini. This was excellent. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yummy. Another Pink Pie Crust Zucchini. I did two of those. And I love these because it's like you just take it out and throw it in your warmer. You don't have to break it. You don't have to chop it. What's this one? This one is burnt sugar zucchini bread. I get the corn chip vibe in this one, unfortunately. So what I was, what I've been doing is mixing it with like a fruit or like a blueberry to kind of tone it off a little. Anyway, moving on. Pink cookie bakery, which is like a pink sugar and cookies. This was really good. I had two of those. I melted those. Um, this one is I Smell Children from, <laughs> from VCS. And um, it's one of her sampler uh, two ounce cups. And this was from August of last year. It smells great in the, um, in the cup, but it was very, very light. This one is Who the Fudge is Martha Stewart, and it's Cupcakes at Tiffany's, Zucchini Bread, Vanilla, but <clears throat> Vanilla Butter Fudge, and Butterscotch Fudge. And this is really nice. If you like butterscotch, you get more of the butterscotch. This is a beautiful blend. You don't get too much of the zucchini. It's more of the butterscotch, but I like butterscotch, so I'm okay with that. Um, the next one I have here is, um, <clears throat> excuse me, one second. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry, I had to take a drink of water because I'm like, <laughs> so this is from the pharmacist's daughter and, um, it's a mint blend and I didn't realize that, uh, there was leather in this. Holy, I can still smell the leather. <laughs> I put this in my candle crock down here and this went for like days, <laughs> a couple days. And even after I took it out, I could still smell the leather. If you like leather, get her blend. <laughs> it was different. It was different. But anyway, that was from the pharmacist's daughter. Um, I finished the uh, scoopable tart wax uh spice zucchini bread and i like this one because it has a spice to it so i finished that that's that one there sorry if i didn't show the last few oh my gosh i love this one 
Whew, this is Lucy and Ethel's Cafe, and it's pistachio coconut pudding cake topped with marshmallows, fresh strawberries. I think I missed out on that order, but I'm going to see if Kay's can make this, but so, so good. So good. I loved it. Super Tot Wax um, Pear, pear it's called Perfect, and it's Pear uh, strawberry and ginger ale. This was nice. Mm, I can still smell it. Good. Very good. Is that all my, I think so. Okay. Let me go over really quick the, um, what I'm still finishing up. Um, I'm working on Savannah blue and it's a uh, triple layer fizzy and it's uh, cherry fizz, strawberry fizz, and lime soda. This is so strong so good i'm working on um love quinn by vcs and this is from 2021 and it's uh blueberries and cream blueberry cobbler and cupcakes at tiffany's this is so strong you only need like i chopped this one up and just a small cube it's probably why it's taking me a moment to get through it um i'm also working on Teddy B's Cookie Monster. This one is, it smells so good in the, in the bag, and but it's very, very light. And what I've been doing is um, just kind of blending it with other scents, but it, it, it is a good cookie scent, but it, it's, it's light. But still like Teddy B's. Oh my gosh, this one. I went over this in one of my D stash videos um, and oh my gosh, I fell in love with this. It's uh, strawberry Paris, strawberry pound cake, pink sugar and cotton candy frosting. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be sad when I'm done with it, but it's so good. And um, I actually just placed an order with uh, Swanky just a little while ago. So um, I'm actually starting to really like swanky a lot right now. So anyway, so I'm working on this loaf. Um, I'm working on uh, Blanche and Baby Jane and it's pink sugar with vanilla butter fudge. This is strong. Oh, it's so good. Okay. <laughs> and then um, this is another strong one from BCS and it's... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me uh bubble gum birthday cake vanilla bean noel and gooey marshmallows and if you like bubble gum this is so good strong you only look at like a cube like that <laughs> that's what you need it's very strong but it's very good too so you gotta be in a bubble gum mood to you know what I mean melt it so Anyway, guys, that's my um, my empties for June and kind of what I was melting that I didn't finish, obviously, with some of the loaves. But um, I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. Um, happy 4th of July. Uh, and um, just want to say thank you for watching. And I hope you all have a wonderful day and night. Take care. Thank you.